So you might ask, what is the Pi system as an infrastructure? And to answer that, what is a data infrastructure in the first place? There's people out there who want data. Maybe you. And you have sources of data, pieces of equipment, maybe pumps, that have all sorts of information that you want to see. And to attach you to the data didn't take much work. Attach yourself to the data, not a problem. And we brought in some new equipment. We need something to get the data from here to here, so we brought in not a problem at all. Hired other people. Well, they need to use the data too. We'll attach them in with a different solution. We acquired a site. What happens when you acquire a new site? Well, there's a whole lot of data attached with that. It probably brings with it a whole new set of people and their own way of attaching themselves to data. And now we need to integrate these two things. And well, well that gets taken care of. Yeah, all right. They're off in headquarters, so bring in a connect all this together. And this has become our data infrastructure. It's what connects the data we have to where we want it to go. That's where an infrastructure is. What the Pi system does, so you have sources of data, new plants, equipment you've had for years, you've had equipment you bought last month, places where it needs to go, colleagues. The Pi system connects to any source of data, to anywhere it needs to go, all from that one place. The Pi system specializes in connecting to anything out there that our customers use. So as soon as you bring in a new system, it can get out to where it needs to go immediately. Instead of custom solutions and silos and different vendors, wherever your data begins and get it to wherever your data needs to go. That's Pi as an infrastructure.